This will fix the cracks that have appeared in some of her organs. Hey guys, what's up? LD Shadow Lady here, and today we're going to be playing some fun games that I have found on the internet with fantastic reviews. Okay, that's a lie. I haven't actually looked at their reviews. I'm not even sure they have reviews. So the first game we're going to be playing is called Stomach Pain Doctor, which is a technical term for the kind of doctor that takes care of your stomach pains. Okay, I should probably mention that Stomach Pain Doctor is not the legitimate terminology for it, nor do I know the legitimate terminology for it, so I'm not even going to go there. Rhea is eating a pizza without knowing that it is old and it was ate by some insects, so she falls sick. Now she has to meet a doctor for her stomach pain. You are the doctor who can give treatment for Rhea's stomach pain. There is not much time left, so let's start the treatment. <laughs> Are you ready to handle the equipment? Yes, I am. Okay, so this is presumably Rhea eating the pizza that was eaten by some insects. Oh, she eated that up good. Mmm. Oh, oh, no. Actually, that's a bit unusual. F f what? I should probably go see a doctor now. And this is where we come in. So we should probably use... Oh, we should probably use this... Thermometer? Stick it in her eye. Oh, no, apparently her mouth. I learned something today. Okay, now we've got a magnifying glass. Why do we need a ma- Girl, you got some nasty teeth. What are these instruments? They're like child-friendly instruments. This looks like a hairdryer. Oh, no, that's, that's a water sprayer. Oh man, oh, that sucks it up. Okay, now what? Okay, what do we do with this? We examine. These guys. Oh, that makes them bigger so we can pluck them out. No. What? Yes! Let's get this one out too. That's kind of gross, girl. Now let's try and brush this all away. Oh, that's coming off nicely. Okay, now they are sparkling clean. I don't know why the stomach pain doctor is doing teeth pain doctor work, but. Oh, here we go. Next. Scan lab. Scan lab. Okay, right. We're gonna use this again. Interesting scanning. Right, and then this. What? There are a lot of, I can see a lot of things in there that I'm not sure should be there. Ice, we need ice? Because this is a totally legitimate medical treatment for things. Just whack some ice on there and it sparkles. Anywhere else need icing? How about these? I don't know what these are, but I'm icing them off. Okay, we're done with that. Now we need some kind of nail polish with, what is this? I don't even, what is this? Just spray things away. Spray it all away. That might have been perfume. Okay, now what is this? This will fix the cracks that have appeared in some of her organs. Okay, what is this for? Oh, this is another sweeping brush. Sweeping brush. We'll just sweep her intestines. Lovely. Okay, next, moving on. Oh, that's disgusting. We'll just suck it right up. <laughs> And then we'll use the scissors to cut the hair of these things. I don't really know what I'm doing right now. Oh, there's one up here, right in your throat. There we go, chop that. Now what's this, a screwdriver possibly? What's this for? What? I don't even want to know. What is that? Don't know what this is. Oh, apparently it's some kind of vaporizer. Okay, now what's this, we've got an antacid. Yes, I'm pretty sure that you don't need this kind of mechanism, but okay. All right, fill her up with that. I think that's 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 good. And then digesto, whatever that is, fill her up with that as well. Okay, now we're giving her an injection or possibly taking some blood. No, we're giving her an injection and we're also giving her some tablets. Now, I'm not sure how medically accurate that game was, but I'm pretty certain that I now want to go into a career in medicine. Okay, I'm just looking for a new game to play now, and I'm honestly rather disturbed by the amount of kissing games that I've found. <laughs> Some of them are really specific. Skate park kissing. Yellow bus kisses. Oh my god, first aid shellfish allergy. Now, I'm not sure that anything could top stomach pain, Doctor, but if anything will come close, it will be first aid shellfish allergy, so let's play. Oh, we're at some kind of seafood restaurant. She's thinking of the lobster. She's eating the lobster. She's loving the lobster. She, oh, that, Ooh. call 911, we've got to call 911. Actually, in England, we've called 999. Okay, we're calling. 
They've arrived. Okay, that was fast. Didn't even have to specify. We got that new psychic link. Okay, first of all, we gotta check the heart rate, then inject epinephrine, and then start an IV, and then give a charcoal pill. And then comfort the patient. Can do. I've forgotten the first thing. <laughs> what was the first thing again? What's this? That is the heart rate. We're checking the heart rate right now. That's an interesting looking heart rate. Done. Now we're giving her an epinephrine. Boop that in you. Okay, in the arm there. How do you, there we go. That's injected into the bed. Oh, her lip swelling has gone down now, so that's good. Um, next we've got to start the IV. She's got her color back now. Okay, and um, what's this, a charcoal pill? I don't know what that is, but let's just give it to her. In my medical opinion, I don't know what we're doing here. Okay, now we'll just make her feel better. Um, okay, just give her some kisses. Everywhere. Okay, I think we did it. Happy story, guys. She's a lot better now. She's over the shellfish allergy. Okay, let's play this one. What is going on with your hand? You probably should have come to me sooner. First of all, she's got some kind of thorn in her hand here. So let's just grab that. Oh God, they're everywhere. Soap because of all the germs, because that is just disgusting. And then, I don't know what this is. What is this? Ew. What is that? I don't know what that is on her hand, but I hope I never have to see it ever again. Of all the games I've played so far, this is by far the worst. Okay, and lastly, we've got cracks in, hand, in the hands that we need to just fix up there. Don't know how that happened, but uh, actually you have kind of freakishly large hands for such a small lady. Let's do it. Oh my god, woman! Why is the back of your hand so gross too? Okay, I've decided being a hand doctor is not the life for me. <laughs> Let's play the game called Gain Money to Shopping. As the girl has great love for fashion, she wants to have lots of money to pay for her passion. To help her, please try to collect as much as fruits and flowers as you can to gain money. Then feel free to go shopping with her, have fun. Which one do I press? Whoa, okay, so we're supposed to slide along this skateboard and catch all the... I don't even know what kind of fruit this is. Plums, peaches, nectarines, I don't know. This is probably not the most effective method of fruit collection. Whoa, I already have $240? I wish real life was like this. Come to me fruits, get in my basket. Does this just go on as long as I want it to? Cause I'm pretty sure $700 is enough. Let's try this thing. Oh, these are flowers, now we're collecting the flowers. You know what, I think we'll just go shopping. <gasps> oh, <gasps> what is this? What is that? Is it a bag? I don't... How about this? This is where everyone realizes that I have no fashion sense whatsoever. And it's embarrassing. I'm gonna have to give her some hair now because that hat's just made her look bald. <gasps> this one's so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, I know what I want now. This, this, this bag. Not, whoops, not that bag. This hair and this hat, please. Okay, now I can dress myself. Put the hair on right. You don't want it to go on wrong because that would be embarrassing. Like that, that's just embarrassing. Oh no. Okay, I'm done. Now what, is that it? Show. Fabulous, darling. <laughs> well, I'm glad we did that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me trying out some very interesting games. I hope you learned a lot today about medicine and fashion alike. If you enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like. And if you have any suggestions for more games I should play, please leave them in a comment below. And subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time. I well, that I was a Mormon, but I'm in fact not a Mormon. Next is, why does LD Shadow Lady? Don't quite know how to answer that question for you, buddy. My real name's Lizzie, or Elizabeth. Well, currently I'm 22, but if it is your birthday today, then happy birthday you. I'm gonna give in to Temptation and try one of these kissing games because they just sound ridiculous, and I'm gonna choose, what is this? Okay, let's go. I didn't even read the instructions, just assumed it's gonna be... What? I'm just gonna pick one. Oh. Oh, hang on. Oh, oh no! I think that one's the cow. Ah. I was supposed to pay attention there. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention. I have literally no idea which one's which. 
Uh, I'm assuming that I'm trying to find the young attractive female, not the old lady or the cow, but I mean, I'd be happy with Edith. Oh no. Which one am I supposed to go for? <gasps> no, it went so fast. <gasps> oh my gosh, I don't know at all. I think this one. Oh no, not again.